Welcome to Epcot. Hello friends, my name is Jackie and you're watching Super Enthused. I'm at Epcot today for the 2019 International Flower and Garden Festival. And I have a friend with me who's somewhere. It's Adam the Woo, who's also making a video. What are we gonna do? We're gonna carry this umbrella around. Carry the umbrella. It might rain. It might rain. Check out the beautiful topiaries, the beautiful flower things, and eat. The wonderful things. We're gonna check out the wonderful things. You say eat? Oh, we're gonna eat. I think there's a reason I tagged along. Oh, we're gonna eat. I'm hungry. Let's go. Am I supposed to no, no, no. follow let's, you? Let's go. Back up, back up. You're gonna edit that out, right? <laughs> totally. Surrounding the pretty daisy topiary, they have petunias and gerbera daisy flowers. And she's right in front of Spaceship Earth. And we're gonna go in and see all the topiaries, including my favorite. I'll let you guys know which my favorite is, and you let me know which is your favorite topiary in the comments below. It's the doggy topiary area with cute Pluto, so cute. And then on the other side is Goofy. And he's welcoming you to enter the Flower and Garden Festival. Last year I didn't get to go inside the Butterfly House, the Goodness Garden Butterfly House. So this year, we're going in to check out the butterflies. There's a few pretty butterflies clinging on to the sides of the tent. Right in front of the Imagination Pavilion. First, they're an egg. <laughs> then, they're a larvae. Larvae, larva, caterpillar. <laughs> then they're a chrysalis. And then they're a butterfly. This little butterfly is relaxing. It was fluttering around a little bit, but now it's just chilling. Right in there is a bright yellow caterpillar. It blends right in with the flowers. And that's gonna be a butterfly not too long from now. Here's another one relaxing on a flower just out of the way. <laughs> the Mickey and Minnie topiaries with the flowers around them are so pretty. They're kind of like a central focus right now and there's a huge photo pass line for photos in front of them and the American Pavilion is lined up right in the middle. So there's a lot of really cool photo pass spots during flower and garden. You'll definitely want one here. The figment topiary is always a very popular photo spot, especially with the monorail going behind him. Beauteous. Glorious. <laughs> that is what it's all about. The Pineapple Promenade is where you find the very popular frozen dessert violet lemonade drink. It's delicious and I got one. Here's what the violet lemonade drink looks like. It's non-alcoholic. It's like a slushy. It's got a little violet flower on top. It's so delicious. I also picked up a festival passport and it's just like at Food and Wine and the other festivals where each of the pavilions you visit, you put a sticker in there to show you've been there. So the Violet Lemonade, as I mentioned, it's a slushy texture and it's got the little violet on top. It's so pretty. It's a really lovely presentation. Let's taste it. Hopefully it's as good as last year. Mm. Mm. As you bring it up to take a sip, you smell the violet. The smell is very soft yet strong. And the taste is just, it's so perfect. It's so perfectly balanced. And I talked about this last time I had it, but I hold firm that it's just, it's not too sweet. It's not too mild. It's just right. It's delicious. It lives up to the hype. There you go. Completed. One page of the passport. 
Let's see if we can fill in some more. All right, so generally you're here with a friend and you get two things, maybe you get two different things. You can each try something. We got the same thing because this is the thing to get. Got the tuna tataki here with some mango on it, some avocado, and it's on a papadam crisp. I got the good one, so I'm gonna mark it off on the passport here right there from the citrus blossom so everything is citrus based so it's like lemony let's try this Ooh, the crisp is like it's like soft but hard you got twice the crisp that i, I did. really did i'm sorry you're going full crisp and i don't know what these little bubbles are it doesn't say what those are fish eggs maybe mm. it's good this crisp is really interesting. It's really light and flaky. It's very delicious. It's a nice blend of flavors. Citrusy, umami. Good stuff. Time to put the sticker in the passport where it goes in the citrus blossom page. There we go, page number two. Let's keep filling this up. Northern Bloom is the pavilion that's put up here in the Canada area. And on the official festival table of Epcot, we have seared scallops with French green beans, butter potatoes, brown butter vinaigrette, and applewood smoked bacon, beef tenderloin tips with mushroom bordelais sauce, whipped potatoes, and garden vegetables. This one's mine, this one's Adam's, Watch both videos to get a full review. The beef tenderloin tips from Northern Bloom in Canada. It looks really good. It's over some nice whipped potatoes. Let's try this. Take a nice baked beef tenderloin tip. Mmm. Mmm. This is comfort food at its finest. It's got this gravy. This juicy gravy sauce that's covering the potatoes. Time to fill in another page of the passport. We're making our way around right now. We're at Northern Bloom. So that is a maple leaf, it looks like. Appropriate, appropriate. Here we go. There we go. Canada. We love you, Canada good place with good people and good food. You can call me Flower if you want to. And there's Bambi. And there's the friendship boat. Instead of being stuffed with fluff, he's stuffed with topiariness. The wonderful thing about Tigger is that he makes a really nice topiary. And Piglet's gotta cheer up Eeyore. I mean, he's surrounded by flowers. I feel like he'll be cheerful today. In past years, we've seen Peter Pan on the top of that building. And then sometimes he's here fighting with Hook, having an epic battle. This is a new, at least to me, topiary. And it's Miss Piggy in her dressing room getting ready for a garden party. And this is in the France Pavilion. And wherever you find Piggy, you also find Kermy waiting to take her on a nice bike ride with some bread through France. Barely even friends. Then somebody bends unexpectedly in this poor provincial town. Good morning, Belle. We stopped at the Florida Fresh booth, which is focused on local Florida produce and food items. And Adam got these spicy blackened shrimp. So if you want to see a review of that, mmm, with cheddar cheese grits, watch his video. And I am going to try the watermelon cucumber slushy. You can get this with or without alcohol. I got it with. It's a warm day. This looks really refreshing and it has a giant chunk of watermelon in it, which is always good on a hot Florida day. Mmm. 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 Cheers. Next page to check off, Florida Fresh. We got food, we got a beverage. This is the Flor state of Florida with a flower. So we'll find that one. It's right there. Peel that off. 
and mark it as done. I've spotted Adam hiding behind the trash can. He thinks no one can see him. We've ordered two dishes from Hanami in the Japan Pavilion. We have a chilled soba noodle salad with pan-seared tuna and wasabi dressing. It smells so good. And karage with nanban sauce. So it's Japanese style fried chicken served on a bed of shredded cabbage and topped with soy and vinegar based dressing. This is so good. This is my favorite thing so far. If it's a particularly warm day when you're here, this is really cooling and refreshing and it's very umami. It's got delicious flavors. Just crossed another page off of the passport. Here we go. Get the right sticker, match it up to the design in the passport, and check it off. There's another Mickey and Minnie in the American Pavilion, and they're surrounded by giant, beautiful sunflowers. America, spread your golden flowers. And now it's time for my favorite topiary at Flower and Garden. It's Snow White and she's got a lizard on her hand. She's friend to all the animals. Look, it's a little lizard having a lovely time on her princess hand. I gotta give him a shout out. Shout out to the lizard. She's moved to different spots during different years and sometimes she has all the doors around her but right now she's only got one and he's a little dopey. Double potato pancake time. Adam got the ham, I got the applesauce. A la wishing well. This is from the Germany Pavilion Festival booth. Let's, let's try this. It's a good combo because it's like salty and sweet. Filling up the passport today. Right here. It's right there. Delicious. We're about to take a trip to Arendelle. We're not gonna let it go till we ride the frozen ride. Yay! The Gardener's Terrace area has a bunch of cool festival specific merchandise that is very cute. They've gone all out with the festival gear. They have all sorts of cool stuff. Like lawn statues. Oh, these mugs are really cute, I like them. And no shortage of flower ears. This is an example of how they make those round floating gardens in the lake. But this is like pretty heavy, but it also feels hollow. And this might be like, maybe this floats or something. It doesn't really explain what the tricks are. So we're left to our own devices to try to figure it out. Either way, they look really beautiful on the lake. A fan favorite of the Garden Festival. Look, it's the lavender drink. Put a little zest in your fest seems to be the catchphrase, the slogan for this year's festival. And this is the delicious, delicious drink I had first thing in the day. The Jam and Gardeners are playing behind me and they draw quite a crowd. It's really fun. Everybody dances and has some fun. And I'll show you a little bit of what they do right now. No! We're the Epcot Jam and Oh, oh yeah. The last flower and garden festival task of the day is to collect our special festival pass holder magnets from Mouse Gear. So today we're gonna get our Pluto magnet and then I will make sure to come back for the Daisy magnet because it is so cute. Got it! I love it! 
I love how it comes outside of the circle with his little ear. It's going right on the fridge with the others. That's right. Just move your arm a little, a little to the right. Really? Am I holding it? There you go. You got it. Come over here, real quick. Come over here. Look, it's the real spaceship Earth through that crack. It's quite a sight to behold, and we've been beholding it, it all day long. Did you have a good time at the Flower and Garden it. Festival? Look at this. Wait. That's so cute. Wait These for are the it. New, Look at this. Spaceship Earth. The new reusable like bags. One dollar. Delicious food and treats. The topiaries are so pretty. And we got our puzzle magnets. Yes, I got it. It's in my back pocket. Me too. Crank, crank, crank. Check out Adam's video on the Daily Woo channel. He's going to show some different stuff, a different perspective of the day. Give yours a thumbs up. Give me a thumbs up. They can go over to my channel. Go to Adam's channel. Give me a thumbs give up. Give him a thumbs up. They watch and comment, like, share, subscribe, and follow me on every social media platform. <laughs> Repost, retweet, etc., etc. for both of us. He knows the whole deal. You're going to get a thumb workout and you're going to feel good about yourself. Hey, thank you guys so much for joining us. Hope you had a good time. I'm just going to wave until, you, until you're done. Okay, perfect. And until the next time, you know what to do, right? Can you tell them? Stay super, not moderate, super enthused. <laughs>